How's everyone doing? So welcome back to another video. Firstly, I just want to apologise for the lack of content over the past couple of months. I've been on a little bit of a campaign in the canal to try and get a three pound per chat or potential new PV. Um, but after a couple of months of hard work, it finally came good. So stick around to the end of the video to see what I catch. So the past couple of months I've been on a little bit of a mission on the canals to try and catch a three pound perch out of them. Now I'm completely new to canal fishing, I've fished them here and there in the past but never really done that well on them, especially when it came down to perch. So we're going to take a trip back to late March where I did my first session on the canals for them. So on that session I decided to opt for small crankbaits, sort of try and find some of the smaller perch to just locate where they are at. But I was in for a little surprise, so just take a look at this. That'd be one. But today is literally just about trying to find the fish. I'm not bothered about size. I just need to know whereabouts are living. Because if you can see, there's not much feature. Oh, yep. Might be. Oh, that's a really good perch. That's a really good perch. I'm on that someone back. Oh, there we go. That's what I'm on about. Really lightly hooked. <sighs> Cracking fish. There we go. Look at that for a perch. He's banging. I was only going for the small ones, so I'll take any fish that size. So after a few more sessions, I lost a bit of confidence. I didn't see many signs of fish, I didn't catch anything other than that one and I decided to move on to a different stretch where I had a bit of a better result. Still chucking about the small, small Z-Man bugs, don't know what colour it is, but just down by this log here. The thing is there's a lot of floating debris which is making it really awkward, catching on a lot of weed today. But we're just going to keep on going. We're going to stay grinding and uh, hopefully we'll pick up a fish sooner or later. There we go, just a little one to start off with, let's challenge on. There's been two methods I've chose when targeting these canals. So the first one being a bit more of a searching method. I've been using small shads such as the Western Shad Tees or the LMOB Kofi Perch. These have caught me numerous fish over the past so I feel confidence using them and I know that I can find a few fish, big or small, I don't matter, I just locate them. So the other tactic I've been using is a small creature bait either rigged on a weedless setup or on a small jig head on that head. The reason I've been fishing weedless is there is a lot of low lying debris or low lying weed on the canal at the moment. So using that I can get over it. Um, but they're so simple to set up so I'll just show you now. So firstly I grab my three gram chub weight, I then take the weight off and slide the size one VMC offset hook onto the clip. After that, I put my weight back on and then tie the Cheb weight to the main line using a Palomar knot. I found it to be much stronger than any other knot. And then after that, I simply rig up my chosen creature bait. For me, it's a Z-Man Bugs. Um, the reason I'm using something quite bright, like a white one, is I, it stands out a lot more at the moment with a sort of with how coloured the canal is. I've been messing around with like dark coloured baits but I seem to get a lot less takes compared to when using something bright like a white or a pink bait. Um, so yeah, that's just what's working for me at the moment. So the weekend just gone, we decided to move to a different stretch after talking to my good mate Steve. 
So we got to the stretch, sort of about five, six o'clock, fished it for about two, three hours into dark. So I took my two rods with me. I took my spinning rod, which had my shads on, so I was trying to find the fish, and I took my creature bait rod. So after a bit of fishing for a while, I decided to flick out a small shad just across some weeds, because I knew it gets a little bit weedy around this area. And next second, my rod absolutely slams around, and I have this. So the shot got me a little bit and I didn't actually record that much footage of the fish so I do apologise about that. So I decided to go down the day after. Happy days. And there she is. All 44 centimetres of her. She's gorgeous. Just had on a small Z-Man bugs. Okay, get a quick weight and slip her back, but I think she's a new personal best. There she is. Gorgeous fish. Look at the back on her. With the sling just under four. So hopefully she's in mid three. She's got the strength to go. 